As drivers prepare to navigate the north split closure this weekend, pedestrians on the Monon also being asked to reroute. And News 8 Sarah Hignite joins us now. And Sarah, there's uh, a new development going on that's specifically being built for people who use the Monon near the busy interchange. Yeah, that's right. So they're calling it the Monon Loop. And once construction gets underway with the north split, INDOT will have to close a portion of the trail for safety. But they didn't want that to impact pedestrians in the area. You ready? Let's go. Mark Daniel and his dog Bo use the Monon Trail near the North Split and play at the fields almost every day. Especially when it gets warm, it's packed. Um, when people get off work, sometimes it gets uh, overcrowded almost. He was excited to hear that they wouldn't be losing out on part of the trail because of construction. So you don't ever want to slow down anything in the trail because people really do use this exercise and they love it and they've comes with part of their life. So we don't want to slow anything down. We just want to keep the process and keep it moving and um, then eventually we'll have more options available. And uh, we'll have to close a portion of the trail while the project is underway. There's a section of the Monon that goes basically underneath the north split and obviously we can't have people there during construction for safety reasons. But when one trail closes, another opens. INDOT is currently building an extension that will serve as a loop to go around the construction and connect the old north side trail to the cultural trail at 10th Street. That's actually really beneficial because I will often come onto 16th, onto the Monon, and for that to be cut off, that kind of cuts me off from the cultural trail in downtown. So to have an additional trail that I can go on, it's actually really, I didn't know that was going to happen, so I'm kind of looking forward to that now. The new widened 12-foot multi-use sidewalk will not only give pedestrians a view of the progress over the next 18 months, but will also increase accessibility in the area. With it being close to bottle works and the garage and all of that, um, yeah, I feel like it'll get a lot of views. The Monon Loop is expected to open in about a week, and Dot says that they'll not close the existing trail until the new section is ready. And when construction is done, both the existing trail and the Monon Loop will remain open. Reporting, I'm Sierra Hignite, Wish TV, wishtv.com, and follow us on Facebook.